tantrums after they just ended NBA awards that happened oh, some few uh, you know days ago. Now the pop star allegedly is trashing the award and claims that she still remains the queen of the award so far. Well, fans say that this lady is very confused and does not know what she's talking about. Meanwhile, she stands by her own words and of course has gone to uh, you know post something very interesting on her gram. We'll get to that very soon. But this is the change up in next news. Please don't forget to subscribe and like our page. It's very important. So we get you the latest from the world of art entertainment. We're grateful so far for the subscription. Now we all know that the MVA awards just happens just some fast, I mean past uh, days. Uh, we did see the glitz and the style and of course uh, the controversial performances by many on stage like the likes of Cardi B and Megan Thee Stallion who of course some say the fans, I mean their performance was okay but just with a song that was a bit, you know, whack. Well, that conversation has been had. Well, after the awards we were all thinking that maybe uh, some you know, important, uh, you know, uh, personalities like the likes of uh, legendary, uh, you know, Britney Spears, who are at least going to write something very interesting about the uh, the awards. But let's really get you something that she posted that has really generated a, uh, a conversation on social media. Now, she apparently is not praising the award so far, but she is trashing the award and claiming ownership as the, the queen of the award so far. Well. Truth be told, uh, history uh, has told, uh, or can, uh, you know, uh, I mean, we can revisit history and, of course, tell you that Britney Spears apparently has won about three awards, or maybe more, well, if my fact check is right, I think three or four awards so far are the MVA, uh, uh, you know. Uh, and so she, of course, is, is, is uh, I mean, can't tout that she has won so many awards, uh, if not many, uh, at least, uh, majority of the awards so far, but she claiming ownership is what fans, or some fans, not really understand. So let me apparently uh, get you the tweet she posted on her uh, Instagram and then we can see exactly what she means. Now she says, I've been uh, called the queen of MTV, uh, the woman in me, which is due on October 24th. I can't wait to share more VMAs and other award show uh, memories in the woman in me on October 24th. This is her tweet, I'm talking about, uh, you know, breaking the space. Now, a lot of people really felt that this tweet was not necessary because currently we do know that Britney space has been suffering from so much from the failed marriage, uh, you know, with the Samish Gary. And of course, uh, people are alleging uh, her mental, you know, instability, and of course, the controversial uh, conservatorship uh, between, you know, the family, you know, a whole lot of brouhaha going on, uh, you know, between Britney Spears. Well, undoubtedly, I must be honest, and of course, fact, uh, you know, check can also prove Britney Spears is one of the most awarded at the MTV, uh, MTA, uh, MVA. Oh, wow. Uh, MVA award. So let's do uh, check some past uh, award. Uh, she took, uh, I think this award in particular was done in 2019. Well, yes, I think so. Uh, well, she won uh, this award and look at the reaction so far. So, yeah. Britney Spears. When I used to perform and open mic nights for free in small clubs in New York, one of my biggest inspirations was Britney Spears. <laughs> Britney taught me how to be fearless. She taught us all how to be fearless. She's a pop music legend and the industry would not be the same without her. I used to hang posters of her on my wall and touch myself when I was laying in bed. <laughs> Throughout the years, Britney has given us some of the most iconic music videos and stage shows of our time, and that's why tonight, MTV and myself are honoring Britney and her influence on music videos and dance with the Michael Jackson Video Vanguard Award. of the Michael Jackson Video Vanguard Award, the incomparable Miss Britney Spears.
Britney Spears some uh, past weeks or, or you know, uh, a must uh, to say. And she, of course, uh, claiming that she is the queen of this particular award. Well, it apparently has generated a lot of conversations on social media. But do you feel this is a necessary tweet after the award? Well, if she had apparently uh, tweeted something different about maybe uh, talked about the performance so far, like maybe, uh, let's say, Cardi and Megan Thee Stallion, who, of course, are the hot cake and the most, uh, you know, talked about after the award um, with Cardi, <laughs> Megan Thee Stallion's uh, performance on stage. I think that would have worked according to what fans uh, you know, on social media have been saying. But the reactions so far uh, have also been interesting. So we could also get you some reactions after this interesting tweet by Britney Spears. When I used to perform and open mic nights for free in small clubs in New York. Just, but we won't talk about it because we love Miss Britney Spears around here. Give me more makes me levitate to another dimension. But back to Lady Gaga for the night, because I just remember thinking to myself, like, girl, oh my God. And I also, 2007 through 2010 really just mashed all together because I could have swore it was the same night that Britney Spears had her comeback that nobody talks about. This was a night, this was an evening, because the, when I tell you the news cycle, the following days was just absolutely insane over this, just, but we won't talk about it because we love Miss Britney Spears around here. Give me more makes me levitate to another dimension. But back to Lady Gaga in this meat dress, baby. Um, yes, yeah, so the meat dress, um, I remember uh, she had like three outfits that night. And this was the last outfit that she wore. And she only wore this to accept her uh, award for uh, video music. It was like the video of the year or whatever. She won. She wore this. These are pictures she took backstage after winning. Um, but yeah, this was her first look of the night, like actually on the red carpet. This was her in another outfit. I thought that I took like a picture of the whole thing, but she was wearing like some spiky headdress thing. And she wore this mid show, which is maybe why I can't find a clear picture of her wearing this. But yeah, uh, to answer your question, as far as like the flies, I'm sorry, I just went on a tangent, but um, it was not like eatable meat. It was like very like um, high quality meat. It was covered in chemicals so that it wouldn't smell. And I want to say she wore the dress for maybe an hour at tops. Um, but it was kept in a refrigerator the entire show, which is why she wore it at the end. And the winner for best female video is Britney Spears, Peace of Me. And the winner for best pop video is Britney Spears. And the winner is Britney Spears, Peace of Me. Thank you. I'm in shock right now. I was not expecting this. This is such an honor to have this award right now. And um, I just want to dedicate this to all of my amazing fans out there for all of your support. Thank you. This is dedicated to you. Thank you. <laughs> oh my God. Now, let this be a lesson to y'all. Do not. Do not be fucking with Miss Spears, okay? Because karma's going to come for your job, your hairline, and your pecs. This is Justin Timberlake's first public appearance since Britney Spears got out of her conservatorship. And he's smart enough to let the power of nostalgia take over so no one will be like, ugh, we hate Justin Timberlake. Instead, everyone's like, oh my god, I'm so excited to see NSYNC together. Bravo, Mr. Timberlake. Bravo. Bravo.